this is Mary with All Things Automotive, bringing you here today a 2018 Ram 1500. This vehicle features a 5.7 liter V8 gasoline engine with four wheel drive. There have been no accidents or damages reported to Carfax and this vehicle has had two previous owners. As we get closer here to the front of this sleek half ton pickup, you'll be able to see that it is a metallic granite clear coat with chrome and black accents as you'll be able to see there on the front grille as well as down around those fog lights. Those fog lights will help you out in inclement weather and speaking of inclement weather, we'll come along here to the side and take a look at this vehicle's tires and wheels. This vehicle features black 20 inch aluminum olive wheels and as for the tire treads, you have got a good amount of life left in them, but I'll get you those exact measurements here in just a second, as this vehicle, along with all the other vehicles here at All Things Automotive, has undergone a new multi-point inspection, as well as received a fresh oil change, a new cabin air filter, and a new engine air filter. So you don't need to worry about replacing any of those anytime soon. Here on the outside of your mirror caps, you do have your turn signal indicators integrated into those. And as you'll be able to see here on the inside of the mirror, you do have heated mirrors with this vehicle, which will help to prevent them from fogging up as well as to help de-ice them in inclement weather. All along the top of the windows, you do have rain visors, and behind all of your wheels, you do have mud guards, which will help to prevent not only mud and snow from flinging up on your vehicle, but from anything that might chip away the paint like gravel or stone chips. We'll now take a look here to the inside of this pickup. Here on the inside of this vehicle, you do have a lovely jet black upholstery on these seats for a smooth and comfortable ride. And like I had mentioned earlier, you do have those chrome and black accents making their way up the dashboard. While we're looking over here, I'll just open up the glove box and bring you the results of that multi-point inspection that I was talking about. And as you'll be able to see here on this inspection form, you do have green checks the entire way around. And as for your tire treads, you have 10 30 seconds in all of your tires. And as for your brake pads, you have 13 30 seconds in the front and 12 30 seconds in the rear. So you have a long, long ways to go before you need to replace any of those wearables. I'd also like to mention that with the purchase of this vehicle, you do get the original owner's manual with it as well. So if you have any questions after you buy, you'll be able to look them up in there. We'll now continue on here to take a look at the rear occupant seating. As you'll be able to see back here, this vehicle can seat a total of five people. And you do have a power outlet back here for these rear occupants, as well as cup holders here on the floor and pockets on the backs of both of those front seats. And down on the floor, you do have carpeted floor mat to help keep your floors nice and clean. All the doors do have powered windows as well. I'll just close that door and we'll continue around to take a look here now at the rear of this pickup. As you may have already noticed back here, you do have a pre-installed tow bar for a trailer hitch hookup, and you also have a spare tire behind it if you're ever in a pinch. And all along the bumper, you do have rear proximity sensors. That is what those little dots are, and you also have them in the front. They will let you know if there's anything behind you whenever you're backing up or parking, and you also have a backup camera to go along with that. I will just open up the tailgate to show you how much space you have in the bed. And as you'll be able to see back here, this half ton pickup does have a bed that's over six feet, so you've got plenty of space back here to haul some pretty nice loads. You also have a spray in bed liner to help protect that bed from any nicks or scratches those loads might give it. I'll just put the tailgate back up and we'll continue around here to the driver's side. I would like to mention that you do have a hard trifold to no cover on the top of that bed to help protect whatever you put in there from the elements. And that this vehicle does come with two keys for your convenience and both of them do come with a remote start as well. This pickup does have powered mirrors, powered windows, and powered door locks. And as for the driver's seat, you do have eight-way power seating adjustments, so you can move the seat forwards, backwards, up, down, tilting the seat forward and back, and then true directional lumbar support. You also have a tilting steering wheel, which you can move up and down for your convenience, as well as adjustable foot pedals. And to the left of your steering wheel, you just have your dashboard backlit controls, as well as your headlight controls. I'll now just get inside this pickup and turn it on for you. This vehicle does use its key to start as opposed to a push to start. And now that the engine is running and the dashboard is lit up, you'll be able to see that this vehicle has about 57,840 miles on it. We'll take our attention over here to the left side of the steering wheel, as over here are your dashboard navigation buttons, so with these you can cycle through all the different information and services this vehicle provides to you. And right above those dashboard navigation buttons, you do have your Bluetooth and call controls, as this vehicle does have smartphone integration. And then on the right side of the steering wheel are your cruise controls. We'll now take a look here to the center of this pickup. 
Here in the center of the vehicle, you do have a lovely touchscreen LCD display. And the front driver's seat and the front passenger seat are both heated to help keep you warm in the winter. You also have a heated steering wheel to keep your hands warm as well. I'll just throw it in reverse to show you that backup camera in action. Beneath that display, you do have your climate controls here. A bit farther down, you do have manual buttons to control those heated seats and the heated steering wheel. Your electronic gear shift, four-wheel drive shift, a small space for something like your phone, a larger space here, two cup holders. You do have a small tray up top with two USB charging ports and an aux cord plug-in, and then your main storage compartment underneath. Lastly, we will take a look up as this vehicle does come with a built-in garage door opener. And on the rear window, you do have a powered sliding rear window to really enjoy those sunny summer days. We'll now move on to the last section of this video. Here in the last section of this video, we do want to address that this vehicle is pre-owned, so we'll be looking around for any blemishes, nicks, or stains. We know a lot of our customers come from very far away, so we want you to know what you're getting with the purchase of this vehicle, imperfections, and all. So as I'm looking around the inside of the pickup, I only notice you do have a small stain there on that rear occupant seat. But other than that, nothing is standing out to me. So we'll continue to take a look here now at the outside of this vehicle. Again, we'll be looking up and down for any of those imperfections, starting by coming along here to the front of this pickup. And here along the front, you do have a few scuffs, most likely from stone chips. Stone chipping is extremely common. Almost every vehicle has some form of them. The only way you can really prevent them is just by not driving your vehicle. This vehicle also has significantly fewer stone chips than I typically see on most other pickups with this mileage. And we'll come along here now to the passenger side. A few nicks behind that wheel. This vehicle is a darker color so it does tend to hide a little more than a lighter color might. A nick there. As well as there. Some scuffing there. On that rear passenger side. Now often on pickups where I do tend to see several imperfections is on the top of the tailgate as people don't take care of putting items in and taking items out. And as I take a look here, that is the case for this pickup. You do have a significant amount of wear on the top of that tailgate and some discoloration there on that bed liner. And I will just put the tailgate back up and we'll continue back around here to the driver's side. Some scuffing there on the bumper of the driver's side as well. And Scuff there, a small nick there, and we are back to where we started. That generally concludes this video vehicle tour. This vehicle has a lot of great features to offer. If you're interested in a gray half-ton crew pickup with the ability to seat five, a good amount of space in the bed with a hard trifold to no cover, rear backup camera, front and rear proximity sensors, a spray in bed liner, a pre-installed tow bar, a spare tire, mud guards, heated mirrors, fog lights, rain visors, heated front seats with a heated steering wheel, carpeted floor mats, a rear power sliding window, built-in garage door openers, two keys with remote start, smartphone integration, and four-wheel drive, this is a good option for you. If you're interested in this vehicle, come and check it out at All Things Automotive, located at 21518 Great Cove Road, McConnellsburg, PA. Or you can give us a call at 717-485-4224. You can also check out this crew pickup and other listings on our website at www.allthingsautomotive.com. Thank you for watching this video and have a great day.